Hello. This video is going to go through the process by which a site admin can install the progress bar block into their Moodle 2.5 site. This is on just using the web interface and not using FTP. So here we are looking at the overviews page for plugins. And I'm going to go over here to the administration block and click on install add-ons. So I have a choice here. Either I can upload an add-on and install it from a zip file or I can install an add-on from the Moodle plugins directory, so I'm going to do that. One of the things to note is that you're going to be required to actually log into Moodle. At this stage, you can see I'm already logged in, so it brings me straight to this site. So, And as you can see here, because the progress bar is available for my version, which is Moodle 2.5, I have an option to install. And where this one here, Lesson Objectives, is not available for 2.5, I don't have an option. So I'm going to click Install. So what happens here? Well, the very first thing is that Moodle double checks that this is exactly what you want to do. And if you want to download the zip package from the Moodle directory. And at this stage, it is going to go through a validation and verification process, running some technical tests to check if everything's okay. So the only thing here it's showing me that there's a maturity level might be something to be looked into. But for the purpose of this test, I'm just going to go ahead and install it because it does say the validation has passed. So once it's gone through that page, this is just the same as any normal block or plugin upgrade. I click here on Upgrade Plugin Database now and it will install the progress bar. Click Continue. The progress bar is now installed in Moodle and I can see it down here on my plugins. If I go into Manage Blocks, you'll see now that the progress bar is installed. 